Hey everybody, Dan here with No Games for Old Men, and welcome back to Miasma Chronicles. I just finished a bounty for the sheriff in Sedentary, which had me go back to the White Castle to look for a citizen who had stolen the, uh, the, the gold finder. I can't remember exactly what the term was but that the town uses to, to sniff out gold to collect for the first family's collectors. But unfortunately, the guy who stole it uh, lost it and it got uh, taken by grabbers who didn't know what it was and they just thought it was pretty and so they dismantled it and turned it into jewelry. So the thing is, is completely destroyed. But for doing that and for defeating that grabber, we did get this level 3 shotgun, which I have now given to Diggs, sacrificing the wide boy, which I really liked. I liked that wide spread, but the damage is just too good. The base damage here is double what the wide boy is, so I've just, I've got to go with that. It also has an increased uh, crit chance per target, so eh, we'll just, uh, we'll just go with that. So we are now at the back at the proving grounds and this is where we had found i had mentioned at the end of last episode uh we were going to come back here because there is there was that group of high level miasma critters over here that i think are guarding a treasure of some kind because if i look at the map And I zoom out here, it says, Arkansas Scar, treasures found, zero of one. So then if I zoom in, and then we see here in the Proving Grounds, zero of one. There aren't any treasures in any of the other locations. So the only place that we haven't completed, the only area we haven't completed yet, is this. And so that's what we're here to do. And we've got the red beak over there, and he looks big and scary. But I think we are in a position now, in terms of strength and armament. I think we can handle these guys. Plus, we just want the we just want the experience. So we've got a caster here roaming around. There's a caster over here. We could probably get that reaver. Let's see. Let's uh, see if we can get some high up view. So we've got a reaver there and a caster. Probably have to... If that's a stationary caster, we'll probably have to use a glass bottle to draw him. Draw him out. Oh god. Oh, oh, there is somebody coming. Oh, oh god. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, we are right on the edge. 340 points. Unfortunately, I can't do 340 points worth of damage silently, so... That shadow is going to have to wait. Okay, here comes this caster, and the reaver that's with him is facing the other direction, so I think... Let's see. Uh, yeah, he seems like he will be out of... You. So, boy, it seems really like a really bad idea, though. Hmm. Well, you know what? That's what we're here for. All right, we're gonna put put him there. Oh, 
Oh, digs, you're gonna take acid damage. I had him too close, I forgot about that. Rats. You know what I should do? Is probably give Diggs the... the acid... Uh... thingy? This? Uh... Oh, well, I don't want to give up either one of those, though, on him. Alright, well, we'll keep it on Elvis, then, and we'll just have to pay better attention, because that was... That was a really stupid move on my part. Okay, we have another caster over here, but there's a reaver. Oop, I saw a pickup here. Let's see. Can. Alright, so we can do 130. We would have to do like 260 to the Reaver, because with two attacks, each attack would be reduced by 10, so we'd have to do 260. If... If both of these guys hit their critical shot, their critical hit, we could do it. We could get the Reaver. But if either of them fail, then we're hosed. Um, but is the... Oh, this is still on cooldown for one turn, so we wouldn't even be able to make use of that. Um, let's... Uh, we could get... Ooh, let's see. Can we get around here and get these two guys? Hmm... They look like they're facing each other, so I think if I were to attack... Yep, that one would be absolutely aware of what's going on. So we need to... We need to draw one of them out, like into this room probably. Alright, so we're gonna come back. Here and Diggs, we're gonna put you here. Jade, we're gonna put you way back here. And Elvis, you are gonna be the one to throw the bottle. Well, I've only got two more. Hmm. Well, it's not going to get the caster that I want. I was hoping for the other one. Because that other caster there is... Uh, in the vicinity of Red Death over there. So I was hoping I could pull him. Get him quietly. Then this guy. And then Red Death would be completely by himself. But... Uh, is there another way I can do it? Ooh, that would draw that Reaver, which we definitely don't want. Alright. We'll just go with this. So, when we get back to town, we know we're going to need to buy some Medipods and maybe some glass bottles. Except, the Gauntlet is the next main story quest, so... That doesn't sound like something that would require glass bottles. I think it's just going to be a, like a, a brawl. Okay, so uh, we'll be behind the wall here, so I think that will protect us from the acid splash. So I'm going to go ahead and put digs here. Digs. Um, I was on digs. There we go. Okay. Uh, let's put him there. All 
Alright, this will be an easy shot for Jade. Rats, I should have had her do it. Oh well. Maybe I should have pulled the Reaver instead. Because right now we're kind of wasting a, a rage shot. Oh, that's okay. All right, now is that guy in... Really, the Red Death will not be aware? That doesn't seem... That doesn't seem right. We're gonna put... I'm going this way. Split you guys up. Get you up top here. And let's see if you've got a shot from up here. Ooh. Sure doesn't seem like it. Yeah, you'd be way too close to that caster. From there. This caster, however. Let's just see. Really? I could shoot him? And he wouldn't. Th neither of those re Reavers would be aware of it? Alright, Diggs. Can we get you. into a position where you can hit the caster. Oh! Wait a minute, so his shot will alert the Reavers, but not hers? That doesn't sound right. Alright, cancel that. I feel like I'm, I've, I've got one glass bottle left. <sighs> Alright, well, we do know that we can get this caster. Riding point. So, we're gonna go ahead and get him. Put ourselves right here. Now it's saying it is gonna let him know. Okay, why is why is it not being honest with me? Being, it's not being legit. Oh boy, I wish I could hop over the the bar here. I kind of feel like we just got to go this point. I think I'm out of opportunities. Alright, consumables. Oh, I'm out of uh, energy cells too. Oh boy. Okay, well. That's really disappointing.
So if I cast a Reaver... Uh, is that gonna... Yeah, I could do that. Uh, or maybe let's put him over here. Let's see if we can get that caster occupied. Okay. Well, definitely everybody's aware of something going on now. Okay, and now we're gonna go with Overwatch. This direction. I'll cover you. And Elvis. Um, you are going to go with Overwatch as well. This way. Watch and wait. And Diggs, we're gonna switch you. Actually. we do that, I kind of want to see how Overwatch with the shotgun works. Well, there aren't enough, there aren't enemies nearby. Well, but once they come, once they come to me, then they'll start amassing. I really want to see how this works. We're going to go with Overwatch with the shotgun. Because I want to see if multiple enemies will be hit as they start filling up the area. Nicely done, Reaver. Okay. You guys are just really hoping for a, a super napalm right there. Dude, that Reaver's doing his job, though. He's drawing aggro from everybody. I just don't want him to die just yet. I want him to be able to get one more attack in. Okay, good. Uh, however, here, here's the however, is that I want to get, I want to get a grenade in here, or does Elvis have enough power, no, he doesn't have enough power to get Miasma Blast, which is a real shame. But if I can get, if I can get digs up here. To do a move and shoot. With the shotgun. Okay. Then... Let's get... Elvis... Okay, one more turn before we can do Armor Eater on Red Death. So, I wonder if at this point... Alright, let's put him here. Behind that heavy cover, and... We will toss... Super Napalm right there. That's not going to get nearly as, as many of them as I had hoped. 
So maybe we have Diggs do it. You're closer, Diggs, so you do it. So get all of them burning. And then Jade. Let's see, if we get Ice Gun and Plasma on Red Death. Uh, that can't compound that, can you? So, that's actually not worthwhile. So, let's reload with the dynamo. And then Overwatch to cover this area. Because a lot of these guys are going to have to move if they don't die. Got eyes on it. Um, let's see. Let's go with... I could overwatch with him, too. Go this way with it. Locked and loaded. He's only got two rounds left, but... Nice. Uh, not nice. Ha! Wow. But at least he counterattacked. Diggs does have that ability. Good. Acid death. Another acid death. Beautiful. The fire. Alright, hit the shot. There you go. Almost, Jade. Get him. Yes! Oh, so Your good. Days are done. Oh, I knew you had it in you. Oh, he's almost dead. Come on, get him. Get him. Yes, girl. Absolutely. So predictable. Okay, all overwatches are done. Who's he mimicking? Who do you think you are? Okay. All right, I need to reload the assault. Unfortunately, but I also want to move, and I also want to get an armor eater shot on Red Death. So if I put him back here, or I could even get him over here, or I could even get him over here. Nope, I can't do that. I can get him over here. Okay, we're going to switch to the Bouncer, and let's go with Armor Eater on Red Death. Nice! 200 points. Come on, we can do this. We can do this. Shotgun. Let's put him here, actually. And now we're going to go Shotgun Blast this way. Oh, didn't get the crit though. Uh, turret, how about? So, yeah, the turret does the same amount of damage, 70 or 100 as this dynamo assault. So first we're going to reload the assault. Hold on. 
then we are going to toss out the turret. And we're going to put it right there. Ooh. Yeah, we're going to put it right here. Oh, can it not hit that caster? It's it, It's got distance. Red Death should be dead now. Yes! Awesome. That was weird. What are you doing? Uh-oh. Jade. Oh, he's going for digs. Uh-oh. Alright. Oh! The Reaver didn't attack? Oh no. Oh. Okay, well, that sucks. Because had the Reaver attacked Diggs, we would have gotten a counterattack. Alright, Elvis. Let's have you reload this. Wait, wait, hold on! And in this case, do we go with an Overwatch? I think we do. We could kill the Reaver, but we're, what we're going to do is move Diggs so that the Reaver has to move. Which will then allow a shot. So we're going to go Overwatch this way. I'll keep an eye out. And then Diggs, you're going to come over here. So, okay, no, he's going to be immune to knockback. Doop -a -doop -a -doo. Yeah, let's pull him back here. And then he can overwatch as well with his weapon. Go this way. Get him, get him, get him. Nice. Digs. Why didn't you shoot? Was he just barely out of range? Well, that just ruined Diggs' overwatch. Unfortunately. It. Are you serious? Need some help. Stay down. Okay, good. Yeah, At least we got one of them. That's how you do it. Oh no. He's got the same abilities. Missed. Uh-oh. Okay, well, if you want to blast your own caster. Oh, he was behind the tree. Oh, he lived. All right, Jade is up now, so uh, she's about to take <laughs> lethal damage, though, because she is in danger, danger spot. Let's get her moved, and she can take out this caster. Let's get her to here. No, that's a 10% shot. Okay, if I get her up to here, will she have a shot? Uh, what if I switch to the ice gun? Up here, 63%. What? Uh, do I need to move her toward the guys? Or, what if I... Okay, let's do this. Let's put her... Rats. She doesn't have a shot on, on this guy. She will if I do this, but is that 
close to the explosion. So one, two, three, four, it might be. Oh, here's what I can do. I'll switch to like digs. Have him aim at He can't are you telling me that he doesn't have a shot on this guy even though he had a shot on me? That's bogus. Bogus. All right. Okay, Jade. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to move you over here. You are going to plasma. The shadow. Elvis. Digs. Can you tackle this guy? Ooh, that's going to move him through the acid, though. Isn't it? Alright, what if I moved him to here? I think that's probably the better move. Move him to here. Does he have a shotgun blast on, on these guys from where we are? Not a good one. Alright. I'm trying to path him so that he doesn't go through this acid. So now from here, you're going to do a tackle on this guy. Can I do a jump? Nope. Alright, what are we what are we gonna do here? What do we gotta do? Elvis. Let's get you moved to here. And you are going to take out this guy. Hope it's a crit, because then you'll get another action. It was Think not. I got him. Oh, not bad. Okay, then we need to grenade this other caster. If we do not, he's going to split. So we're gonna do this. This will shake a real good. Not getting up. Trust me. Kick some ass. We just saved ourselves two extra casters by taking that action. Interesting. So the shadow is not immune to tackle when we are when he's not digs. So we're going to tackle this dude. And then we're going to run him back to here. Because he's injured. And this guy's going to pop when he dies. Uh, Jade, you're going to come up as far as you can. 92 and 82. Alright, so you're going to do the silent ice gun. Please hit. Thank you. Alright, now Elvis can definitely do 70 points of damage to him. So we're gonna go. We're gonna go with a bing bing. Can I get 
Okay, got him anyway. Great. Hooey. Well, that was harrowing. That was a difficult fight. Lots of plastic to be had, though, but only little tenors. There's a 30. Whoop. There's another one. Nice. All adds up. Maintenance card. Blue key card with Amatrack maintenance written on it. So that must be... There must be a door over in the trip. What is this? Gross. Looks like they're getting burst out of this muck. Can we set it on fire, please? Can we pull an Ellen Ripley and just torch this place? Nuke the site from orbit? Well, slap me sideways. Oh, nice. Another energy. Okay, let's slap that on something immediately. Beautiful. And does she have a weapon that doesn't have that? Crit round, crit we want. Rage. If I put that other one on this, what about Almadi? She already has it on hers. I could give her another weapon. All right, we'll just leave it for now. We've got the, we've got the new one placed. There's a glass bottle. Exactly what we needed. Uh, I saw something up here. There we go. And I think that's it. I think. Because we already came up on the second floor on this side. So that's that. And we already raided the hotel. Oop, what did that say? Oh, just hide. Okay, so we picked up a maintenance uh, access card. So we need to find that. And hopefully miasma creatures haven't repopulated the train station over here. So if they have, we're going to have to fight our way through it again. I don't remember seeing a door over here, though. Am I... What's happened? Am I, am I nuts? How do I get over there? Oh. Convenient steps. All right, maintenance door. Looking for a maintenance room. Oh, probably this one back here. I see a, something that looks like a card reader. Yep, there we go. Is that a saxophone? It is a saxophone. Gotta have me some of that. Ah, nice. The original is used to torture this large brass musical instrument. It's something called a jazz session. At least that's what salvaged recordings of these <laughs> events point to, as the noise generated by them created mild panic for the listeners. <laughs> uh, oh. All right, and another signal boost. 30% increase in range. What am I using? What has a signal boost? Uh, 
But it's already got 30%. Ooh, if I put two? I wonder? Well, that'll add, that'll make this like cost prohibitive, but still. Okay, well, good to know. Good to know, good to have. So that wraps, that wraps this section then. If we back out, Arkansas Scar, Treasures Found, One of One, Kentucky Hills, Eight of Eight, there are no other quests indicated. So that means we come here to the DRC and we go talk to Beth, is it? Valid battle pass, we have a shot at the gauntlet, one step closer to meeting Diesel D and grabbing the foreman's access card. Yeah, we have to go register, but I don't think Beth was the one that you register with. Anyhow, it, it's in that area. So we'll run that direction, and then I think we will end the episode. That fight went much better than I th thought it would, um, especially since we didn't have any energy cells. We didn't... Oh, that's what I got to do. I got to go buy that stuff before we get involved in an, an arena fight. Because I don't know if it'll give us a chance to prepare. Alright, and I've got 905 plastic. So, let's see what we can get. Welcome to Dormai, uh, sorry about that. Okay, I know that we can buy supers, right? Yes, okay, wow, they are not cheap though. Uh, let's go with a super energy cell. VPN. <laughs> VPN. Uh, do I need a super medipod? Yeah. Thanks. That brings us down to 255 plastic. So, I could buy another... Let's see, I need at least one or two of these. Thanks. And no returns. But, that's all we've got access to. Uh, is there anything we can sell? that I'm not using. Okay, everybody has armor who I want to have armor, so I could sell this one. Could sell one of these. Let me take that off your hands. That'll give us 300. Nice. Nice. Then we can buy another Medipod. I could buy another super. Yes, yes. Denada. Let's see. Ambushers, dehumanizer, antibot. Weapon mods. This is the the lesser energy gain. Okay, uh, I think that's be a stranger, a stranger. probably what we've got. Kind of want to go check out this guy over here. Just out of curiosity. So all of his upgrades are just the 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 tier one. Yeah. That's all he's got. All tier one stuff. Alright, so that's that means we're gonna head over to at long last the gauntlet.
So, as I make my way that direction, I will bid you a fond farewell. Thank you very much for watching this episode of Mutant Year Zero. I hope you're having a great day. And uh, come back next time if you want to see what the arena is all about here, because that will be the next episode. All right, take care of yourselves. And thank you for watching. We'll see you next time. Yeah.